Kentucky are here with us live. Good morning to you both. And Clark, you, you, a lot of people are familiar with you and the agents, uh, the ties to the Marvel Universe, but I didn't realize it's been nearly a decade, I'm told, since your character was actually in a Marvel movie. Are you dying for a reunion with some of those superheroes? I mean, I am. The truth is, I've had so much. We've done 136 episodes of this show since then. And actually, uh, they did an, kind of an origin piece about Phil Coulson with Sam Jackson, younger, in Captain Marvel two years ago. So I dipped my toe in. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, I, I miss those guys, but we had a good run. Yeah. How about you, Ming? Is there an adventure you'd like to see your character meet? Oh, gosh. Um, well, I think she's friends with uh, Black Widow. And, uh, of oh. course, she knows um, Fury. So uh, any of those guys would be great. And right. Thor. Can't. Yeah, to throw in Chris Hemsworth. Yeah, you, you can't leave out Chris Hemsworth. I'm going to agree with that. Uh, we got a little sneak peek here. Let's take a look at the finale right now. I'm wondering if we change the timelines or if they change us. The Melinda May I know would never ask these philosophical questions. Which is the point. How did I become this me? I don't know. But I like this you. And if I'm completely honest, I like this me as well. Mm. And Ming, I think I have it right. You all wrapped this, uh, shooting this uh, quite a while ago. So this has been a long goodbye tour, but this is the kind of the, the, the day. So how does it feel to say goodbye to this character? Um, well, it's definitely difficult when you've played a character for seven, eight years um, and you've been with a group of people that you've enjoyed playing, I mean, not playing, working with <laughs> and playing with. Um, it's, it's tough. It's, you know, it's, it's like losing a part of yourself and losing um, a good friend, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Clark, how do you feel about saying goodbye? What's it been like? You know, uh, as you guys mentioned, this is a character who was killed off in the Avengers, and there was a fan movement called... Colson lives, which I was completely moved by. And then people at ABC and Marvel listened and the show only exists because we, we had this incredible fan base and we've hung out with them at comic cons and at events and between the family we have on the show and that family of the fans, it's been really one of the great experiences I've ever had. Yeah. And just a quick one. What, what are you going to miss most about each other? Clark, you first, just quick. What are you going to miss about her working with her? I mean, there's so just to show up and get to act with Ming is one thing. To get to be involved in a fight scene with her because she's a <laughs> full-on ninja, that's amazing. But the great thing about Ming is you can be already grinding at 6 a.m., having worked for an hour or two, and you're already a little burnt out. And all of a sudden, you'll hear this. And people don't know this because her character is very taciturn and serious. You hear this incredible laugh echoing out of the parking garage, and it, Ming, it means Ming's arrived, and I really miss that. I have to call her up and just get that laugh sometimes. Okay, Ming, you got to give me a, a quicker response than that. Give me, give me one word. What are you going to miss about him? Oh, the one word. Um, Two, three. <laughs> okay. Uh, his, uh, he, he's, uh, his effervescent, like, just... <laughs> You know, personality. I mean, I. All right, guys, guys we got. We got to leave. We got to leave it there. The two-hour finale is tonight, of course, right here on ABC. <laughs>